So I think to start off with, we'll both take a stinger team and an ammo truck. So yeah. they get ammo. Yeah, so they can get ammo and just uh, so basically set up stingers on route. more to the right than I expected. Like, I'm full left rudder. Oh yeah, that crate that's already there is an ammo truck, so that's good. Alright, I'll take the ammo truck. Yep. Uh, we'll both be taking an ammo truck, because we'll be uh, setting up a man pad site at Clubhouse as well. Alright. So basically, we're just securing the route at this time. Oh, I'm skiing right now. Yes, you are. I'm down. Oh, no. I did it. You okay? Um... Something's missing. Your tail. What's it called? Uh, sundowner guy started joining. I look left and I let go of the joystick for some reason. And I look back and I see my thing lift up and to the left. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'll go ahead and grab this crate now. Try and. Not do that. Oh, I see the problem here. It doesn't look like my rudder wants to input. Uh, I think we reduced your saturation. Yeah, no, I know that. I'm just saying not as much as it. Yeah, something's up. Um, so it, it's doing the full 80% to the right, but to mm -hmm. the left it's only doing like 20. That's weird. Yeah, something happened here. And exactly not what you want in an American helicopter. Well, also now I gotta set a dead zone for it, which I didn't have to do before. <laughs> We've got one hour left in the mission. Explains why it's so bloody dark. Mm -hmm. What is up with this? Ooh. Yeah, that's barely... Goes all the way right, barely left. Why? Is it a calibration issue? Here, let me unplug it and plug it back in. I think that crashed my DCS. What's it doing? No oh, good. <laughs> Plugging your joystick or just in there. There, I'm plugging in and plugging back in, fixed everything. Nice. The slight dead zone. It's just this, you know the hand rest for the T-1600? No, but go on. No, it's just kind of what you rest your, um, your like pinky on and stuff and wrap it around. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah, that part, it kind of twists left and right a bit. And that kind of moves the dead zone left or right, but not much, nothing to really affect it. Yep, now the rudder works. <laughs> nice. 
Hey Joel, Wondering computer trick. Turn it off and back on again. Oh yeah. Now, um, one other wrinkle. It is currently about negative three degrees Celsius, so about three degrees below freezing out here in good old mm. Georgia. And I am unclear as to the extent of icing simulation in the Huey. Well, we'll find out, I guess, won't we? <laughs> we bloody well will. The, uh, the hind is apparently extremely susceptible to icing, even when it Which shouldn't is weird, ice. it's Russian. Yeah. So, um, well, what I mean is, it gets icing when the conditions technically wouldn't produce icing. Um, oh. so I've got my NIS system <laughs> on. <laughs> that was a weird noise. Yeah, flying helicopters kind of made that happen a lot more. <laughs> it's seen the helicopter tilt forward as you're kind of trying to land, and you're just like, no. <laughs> yeah. Uh, also, um, do you know uh, where your external lights are in the Huey? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. I have those binded to buttons. Nice. Because, uh, you're a Christmas tree right now. Mm -hmm. So yeah, uh, I've got my anti-ice on. I have no idea where yours is. I think there you this go. thing wasn't really meant to be used in cold climates. I doubt it has one. Very good point. Um, it probably has um, an engine anti-ice, but uh, not a rotor one. There was much ice in Vietnam. <laughs> no. Or Korea. Huh? Well, Korea, yeah. Yeah, Korea, yeah. <laughs> but then again, they did send the Choctaw into Vietnam when that thing would literally disintegrate in rain, and they sent it to Vietnam. Not a good idea. Army doesn't make mistakes. Actually, um, one big uh, thing that affected. Uh, the fixed wing guys a lot, especially their missile breed, was mm -hmm. being up at 40 plus thousand feet um, in like, you know, minus yeah. 60 degrees outside, and then diving in for an attack down to like 500 feet, where it's like 45 degrees, 100% humidity. Mm, and just kind of unfreezes all the ice in the engine and floods it. <laughs> Well, more like it um, basically uh, causes clouds to form in every nook and cranny. Yeah. And, uh, like, saturates the electronics. Mm hmm. So all of a sudden, their bomb site goes under, they're like, well. Or, like, the, uh, the, uh, the tech inside the missile gets water yeah. in it. And I'd wager, like, aim nine seekers fogging actually oh yeah all right i got stinger troops in and you said an ammo truck yeah heavy ammo truck heavy ammo truck that's the only ammo truck there is unfortunately all right. uh... it's under ground forces yeah Boink. Nods on. If my rudder's working. No. Oh crap, I'm gonna smack it into the Chinook. Yeah, don't do that. I don't know how low it hangs off the chopper. It so. doesn't hang at all, it's just magicked into you. Ah, okay, got it. So that's why it feels really fat right now. Yeah, so, um, the, depending on what you spawn, the crate might weigh anywhere from 250 to 750 kilos. I think the ammo truck weighs about 500. 
Yeah, it's pretty fat right now. I got yeah. a team of guys in the back. Or guy, singular. I don't know how many are in there when I load in an AA troop. Uh, it's about six guys. Six guys! Okay, this thing's full. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're That's like sitting on each other right now to fit the massive box in. <laughs> yeah. So technically the box would be slung underneath, but... Yeah, um, definitely. For difficulty and server reasons. By the way, uh, your gear are down. Yeah, I know. Okay. I only raise it All once right. I'm on route. don't know how to fly route. a helicopter. <laughs> yeah. The, uh, the K-50 is the only other helicopter in DCS with retractable landing gear, and I don't fly it. <laughs> That one's ancient, isn't it? Well, when it comes to DCS terms. Uh, yeah, because it predates DCS. Yeah. I'll uh, try not to go too fast for you. I'm maintaining a nice 90 knots right now. Yeah. I have no clue what that is in kilometers per hour. Mm, probably like 150. I'm about 190 right now. I can only see you in nods, because surprisingly enough, helicopters stand out and planes stand out like crazy in nods, because it's all the white and green pixels and mm. nods, but then you just see this black dot that isn't pixelated. <laughs> yeah. So I just I tried saw to Raz at one point and called out like two mirages inbound. He's like, where? I'm like, Right there! <laughs> I just way, tried to way. look underneath my nods at my instrument panel by literally looking under my VR headset. Oh, yeah, I've tried that several times. I, I just kind of like look like like it's actually going to change the point of view when I do that. It's just like, yeah. nope. <laughs> I'm starting to get the hang of the hue. I mean, I was able to keep up behind you when we were doing that uh, bit of a chase at like two yeah. feet above the ground. Alright, I think... Uh, Right in the middle of this field, between these two stands of trees, will be a uh, perfect place for one of the stinger teams. Uh, these two stands of trees, I'm guessing it's just these trees that are spaced out like crazy. Yeah. I've got my damn radar altimeter. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. It does help that you have an IR strobe. I don't think the Huey gets one. It gets like an actual just strobe. Yeah. That pops up an IR. Alright, so I'm just gonna land next to you, I'm guessing. Yeah. Come on, bitch, slow down. Now, because we don't have res here, these guys are gonna run about a quarter mile mm -hmm. once we drop them off, so we'll have to uh, drop them off, see where they're going, and then put the ammo truck where they're gonna be. Gotcha. Landing gear. Oh, yeah, I got the Huey nice and controllable right now, it does not want to fight me. Nice! It's good. Didn't even need to trim it, it's just... Yeah, every helicopter has that one speed where everything is just It nice. has that magical speed and it's between like 80 to 75, well 80 to 70 so far. Oh yeah, that came down a bit That hard. was... I mean, that explains the performance of the Russian VDV, they bonk their heads on land. <laughs> Man, this is the first time I've flown this thing on nods, and not having complete peripheral vision makes it difficult. Alright. Uh, city of the troops, get the fuck out! Right. Where do you want to go? Right about there. Power, 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 power. I don't think I hit it. <laughs> so, pretty much like four o'clock. Right about there. I can't read my instruments. 
Oh, it's coming in quick. We're sliding, boys. <laughs> yeah, you need a lot more nose up than that. Oh, oh scraping the nose. Oh. oh, propeller, propeller. Ooh. Well, that's one way to slow down. Right, a lot um, more nose up, so you you're basically yeah. flat rotor right there. So you're just using no uh, fuselage drag to slow down. Mm -hmm. uh, right. I've right. already dropped troops, so you can pick those guys back up. How do I pick them back up? Literally do the exact same thing you just did. So the unload slash load thing. Yeah. Gotcha. There you go. Let's see if I broke something. <laughs> I don't think you did. Alright, they're going right about here. Stop your bouncing. Uh, security commands. my truck. Perfect. Alright. Alright. I'm here. Alright. I can't see where... There you are. Alright. Time to head to Clubhouse. I'm just gonna follow you, cause... Yep. Have you been to Clubhouse before? So it's pretty much uh, straight back the way, straight along the way we were going. Mm -hmm. Pretty much this way. So a good way to get to Clubhouse from Barb Dallas is to overfly this town, hit the river, and hang a right at the far bank. Okay, I'm just following you. Yep. Dang, your strobe flashes really quick. Yeah, it does actually. Like, what are you trying to do, Morse code? I can actually. That's I, cool. I have a button in here <laughs> that, <laughs> that will, uh, <laughs> I can actually hit like a Morse code tapper and it taps out, and I can tap out Morse yep. on my uh, nav lights. You can also do that. Is that a flare? Yeah, that's a signal flare. Ah. I'm guessing you just held a flare gun out the window and just shot it. <laughs> I'm sure there's one in here, but no, that's actually a one of two signal flare banks in the tail of the aircraft. Now with hmm. uh, four slots each, one each one with different color. Ah. Every Soviet aircraft since at least the MiG-15 has had that. Mm -hmm. You see, we have this cool thing called radios. <laughs> Yeah, and Russian radios suck. Mm. Explains why they use the flares. Mm hmm. This aircraft was also uh, intended to fight in MVC conditions, and during a uh, nuclear flash, radios are useless. Yeah. I mean, the aircraft isn't hardened against um, NBC, but it was expected to I operate like that there. one Russian tank that, uh, yeah. what's it called, could stand the nuclear blast wave that looked the moon rover, pretty much. Yeah. Four tracks. Coming right. Oh, I did something with the trim. You okay? 
Uh, why is it tilting that way? Is that better? No, that's worse. Is that better? No. What's that happening? Better? No. I'm trying to find the right spot to trim it back to center. Don't so try, just put button. the controls in whatever position they need to be and trim there. Don't try to think about center. You're good now? We'll find out. <laughs> I think that's the, the major motto of this thing. We'll just find out as we go. Yeah. Alright, so you yeah, see this... 100 knots. <laughs> so you see this little uh, grove inside the trees here? Yeah, give me two seconds. Try not to clip one of these dead trees. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I see yeah. it. That's Clubhouse. Um, what was that? It's a bright flash. Maybe you got shot at. Maybe I did. So, if you place your stinger team somewhere in the open outside clubhouse. Like this field over here where we're at? Yeah. Pretty much anywhere around here, and I think what we'll actually do first um, is uh, build a fob in Clubhouse, and that'll let us spawn all the crates we want. Oh crap! <laughs> you okay? I nearly collided. Yeah, I'm good. I I turned my knobs off so I can read my instruments here. I just look in front of me, I see a massive hind just up here. <laughs> I killed my airspeed, which is good, because now. Smooth landing. Oh, that was close. Alright, and then. They're gonna run for like a quarter of a mile. Yeah. If you uh, go into F10 and click on them, it'll show you. No, uh, the waypoint they're running to. Uh, they're running a lot more than a quarter of a mile. They're running across the river. <laughs> uh, what? Yeah. Um. Pick them up again and drop them again. So yeah, you... I'm gonna drop them a bit farther away from the river because I think what it is is they're trying to set a waypoint that way. It's just the river's there, so. It's... Yeah, that they shouldn't go that far. They were gonna go around the river and then to that side. Ah, that's weird. Mm. So yeah, the hawk site takes like five crates, the fob is only three. Try right here. Alright, where are you boys running? Okay, they're being more reasonable now. Yeah. They're running next to those trees, so I'll go drop their truck off over there. I'll sit down and uh, help guide you on a F10 to the exact point. But uh, the ammo truck has a pretty wide field of effect, so you don't have to be precise. Huh. Cool. Oh yeah, so there's a little like alcove in the trees. Yeah, I see I know generally where they're running. It's on the other side of these trees I'm flying at, right? Yeah. Alright. Try not to crash. Ideally. Yeah, I really hope they add DUH-60 to the game. That would be fun. Mm. Because that thing can actually hoist. carry some pretty decent... Yeah. Or at least let you, um... Fast rope some guys in. That would be kind of cool. That would be awesome. Let's 
Yeah, see that little uh, cutout in the trees? Mm, yeah, I'm like right here pointing at it now, right? Yeah. So that's exactly where they're going. So if you drop the truck pretty much where you're at in that alcove, it'll cover them. Ooh, 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 Come on. Wow, it's dark. Murder me. I'm crew chief. <laughs> Oh, uh, you might want to get it. You might want to get it closer to the trees, just to be sure. The ones right behind you. Right here, where I'm pointing. And uh, ten o'clock. Right there. Right there. Easy with it. So right anywhere there will do. And it's the check cargo option? Uh so it's other CTLD CTLD commands, drop crate. Alright. And then go back into that same commands menu and then unpack any crate. Alright. Nice. Mirage oh. 2000 inbound. Woo! He blew up my ammo. Oh no, he blew me up. Sting her out. Oh. If you uh, look to your 12 o'clock, you'll see a giant flare. <laughs> also known as me, currently. I forgot to warm up my R60, so I can't help. But, uh... I, I'm mega dead. It looks like he's, uh, running. I wonder what the problem is. Woo! There's another guy out there. Splashed well, him. Splashed him, yeah. God damn. So a Harrier and two Mirage 2000s just jumped us. And that is why we set up the Stingers. And why yeah. we're setting up the Hawk site. Alright, so if you respawn back at... Uh, far Dallas. I'll race back and meet you. Kaboom! They get another one? No, you just blew up. What the hell? What the? What the fuck? Did it light you up? No, my trim killed me. <laughs> Did you accidentally flip the, the trim button when it was like halfway, like, upside down? No, I trimmed like I normally do every time I get going, and it just locked my fucking controls. Hmm. Well, I guess now you don't need to race back. So. Yeah, that's true. Alright. Fuck me, I guess. Alright. Let's... Turn all that down. That... Off. That rolling. And this time I'll actually get my R60s. I'm warm bringing up. miniguns this time, just so I have some sort of a chance. Not much, but some. Okay. Bit upset at. Ah, I forgot the inner phone. <laughs> <laughs> Request refueling. Request Copy. rearming. Copy.
thing. This thing defuels really quick. Refueling complete. complete. All right, I'm refueled and rearmed, lifting. Mm -hmm. ah, uh, dead. Don't look down to switch your radios when you're freaking in the middle of taking off. Good job. That was my own bloody fault. Fool to me. <coughs> Let's try this again. One hour left to complete the mission. seen the movie True Lies before? Nope. Ah, uh, I gotta show you the scene I'm, th I'm thinking about right now, but every time I take off at this helicopter, I think of it. Something. Did I? No, nope, that was just me bumping the collective on accident. You okay? Or you need, you need to drop All fine. It's all fine. What do I need to grab from this guy? Uh, so a fob crate. Detail the. I think it's in ground. Ground forces, forces fob crate small. And I don't think we need troops for this one. Not like this. Mm. I did something. You okay? There go the landing skis. No, one's gone. Oh, no, it's beeping. Um, I think you pulled the collective up too fast, and oh. no, it's just didn't control the rudder right because my joystick came off the ground. Again. Yeah. Oh, oh, I'm trying not to collide with you right now. Oh, 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 slow down. Something. Oh, I think. Oh no. Yeah, you exploded. Nice traces. Are you just shooting in frustration? Yes. Okay. I I knocked off my landing ski on the on the Chinook. Mm. Raz did that once. Yes, 
I, I don't think the helicopter needs to be beeping for me to realize. See, the, um, the sky is below us, the ground is above us. <laughs> Actually, it's, it's in here with us. <laughs> uh, let's see what's wrong with it. Engine oil pressure, left fuel boost, right fuel boost, engine fuel pump, 20 minutes of fuel left, the DC generator, the hydraulic pressure, and then the oil pressure. That is a very sick bird. Uh, this is like one that crashed into a window or something. <laughs> um, pilot's vision is going red. That's not good. Excuse <coughs> 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 me. Wow. Fob crate weighs 800 kilos. Yeah, it's heavy. Uh, so this time when you rearm, defuel to like 30%. 30%? Yeah. Okay. It, that still gives you like an hour of fuel, and there's less time of that in the server, so... And it should save you about 800 pounds. Yeah. Uh, do you know where you're going if I just head off now? We'll say yes. <laughs> okay. Basically fly towards the town that you see directly off your nose. Yeah. Get some speed up. I do. It's just they didn't refuel me. Or defuel. There we go. Okay.
great. Oh, thank you, Mr. Beach. Weapons are ready, finally. Just had to get icing right as I arrived. you bitch yeah, yeah. I'm back hello So right as I got to uh, the river, I got Shot down. An, an icing warning. Oh. Yeah. So uh, yeah, my icing system turned on right as I was about to land. And it cut off your engine. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. It's just freaking annoying. Savvy boy. <laughs> oh. I have ten maps too zoomed in. <laughs> oh boy. You got a bearing on the compass for me? Uh, it's about uh, two three zero. I think. Two three zero. No, that doesn't sound right. Um, that's almost right. Uh, yeah, that's about two three zero. Okay. I think I can actually see the strobe light of your helo. No, that's just the town. So yeah, basically from the uh, CTLD area, fly straight over the town that you can see. And then just keep flying that direction until you hit the river, then hang a right. It's a uh, two eight zero from the far. I think I can actually... Nope. Two, eight, zero. Wait, which way is this compass pointing? Go in them weird... Okay, I'm heading the right side.
Oh, wow, you flew. Okay. So from you. Uh, I think I'm yeah. flying head on with you somewhat. I need to take a bit of a right here. Uh, come right 270. Calibrate the compass on this thing because both the arrows aren't pointing the right way. <laughs> so don't go by the pointer needles, go by the compass race itself. Gotcha. Visual on your strobe. I think I see you pop a flare really quick, like a signal one. Oh, yep. there's four <laughs> yeah, flares. Could you pop my flare real quick? Whoa! <laughs> That's a lot more than a flare. <laughs> yeah, I was looking at the I'm wrong thing. Yeah, I see you I'm now. I'm off your uh, two. Yeah. Howdy, neighbor! Hey, howdy! I think the funniest way to pull over a plane would be just pulling up next to it and just opening the door with a minigun pointed at him. I mean... Kinda what happens with UH-60s, except they don't open the door, it's already kinda pointed there. It's yeah. just fun. You just pull over, you just see the minigun spot. <laughs> I'm flying over uh, the first area with the stingers. Yep, that's good. I'm gonna go capture that Mirage 2000 pilot as well and just drop him in the river. Okay. Or if it lets me. I don't know if you can see our enemy pilots. Well, I got two miniguns for a reason. Cool. Fingers and nods when I fire these miniguns, it's just, you can't see. <laughs> yeah. Let's see what it's like for me firing this gun. Probably not as bad, because it's not as high a uh, rate of fire. Two yeah. MiG-21s inbound, looks like they're going to try and circle around for you. Cool. Well, I'm at the FOP right now, so I've got rollers. They're at your, yeah, they're at your, like, 5 o'clock. Cool. About 30 miles, 25. Ah, oh, yeah. Ages away. down that whole time. Yeah, I'm cruising about the right parameters. Perfect. I, I could technically just leave this and it would keep flying for years and years till I hit a mountain. <laughs> nice. Or till I run out of fuel because I only run out of fuel. <laughs> going to circle around the far side of the Roland site. I think they bugged off now. That Harrier is something to worry about, though. That's the one who downed us earlier, I think. <laughs> That's why I put it next to that generator? Yep. Had to put it in that little alcove, huh? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh... that, that's where Raz and I put it. Yeah, but to be fair, Rath has flown this thing a bit more than I have. I can do it. Hmm. It's just gonna be... interesting. This is where I turn on my landing lights. I flip the nods off. <laughs> Actually, I can keep them on for now. Not quite bad yet. Alright. Pull back, slightly decrease collective. Uh oh, ground effect. Uh oh, something's 
trying to spin me. Ground effect doesn't spin you, ground effect just stops you. It's like a cushion. Ground Got effect it. is your friend. We like ground effect. True. Uh, okay, just over these trees. Now, I don't know the feel of how far that tail goes back on the chopper, so for all I know, I'm gonna land only half a helicopter. <laughs> Half a helicopter. <laughs> Not to worry, we're still flying half a ship. Mm hmm. Retard, retard. Yeah, that's what it's feeling like right now. Oh, <laughs> okay. This is going good now. I got it. I got cool. it. Pull back. Right, um, you collective. you can pretty much oh, stay there power. now. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, we're good. We are good. We are good. You know, I'm in a similar scenario right now. Oh, oh, that did not sound. Oh, that. Mm, mm. All right. <laughs> so you can stay there. I've got the last crate. Everything's still attached, so I can unload it here. Yeah. Whew. I think uh, they can be anywhere within about a hundred meters of each other, and it should launch. Should still work. Like uh, half a nautical mile away. That does not look like a mile DCS, but... Okay. That uh, looks like... 500 feet? <laughs> Five. About 300 limit? feet um, is the limit. 100 meters. Mm -hmm. 330 feet if we want to be pedantic. I don't know. That's weird. Well, worst case scenario, I just pick it back up and put it over there. Yeah. I'm gonna do that actually just to be safe. If you want, um, if you don't want to stress about it, then um, I can, I can move it, it when I'm there. I got it. I got it. You'll know if I didn't succeed by a ball of fire. Just know that if you blow up while carrying the crate, we have to get another one. Got it. So I won't blow up, I will crash. Yeah, that, that happened to Devil um, one of the last times we did this. Um, he uh, he crashed because uh, he uh, had a rotor strike while defending against oh, an F-18. That was smooth but terrifying, but... Welcome to Choppers. Smooth but terrifying. I got, I got a nice front row seat of that generator now. <laughs> you know how I said I was moving it closer. Yeah. Uh, when you get the chance, check F10 and you'll see. Oh, I'll see when I get there. Cannot build a. Wait, what do I do? Huh. What was I doing? What, what did I do wrong here? I think I pressed the wrong button. So you're not unpacking the crate yet? You're just placing it? Oh wait, yeah, I was trying to unpack it, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Drop crate. Yeah, I landed like... 30 feet away from the generator. Nice. That you placed. Alright, now you gotta get yourself out of there. Well, I can do that, that's easy, I can just... <laughs> get on out of here. Oh, what's fuel looking like? I might go pick a fight with that F-18 really quick. Okay. He's gonna kill me anyways. Come on, buddy. 
Fight me! Gun test. Oh, let me tell my co pilot. Yep, they work. Wow, I can see this from here. That's a really tall tree! <laughs> Try not to pop the engine here. Um. Why aren't the guns working now? Okay, they work now. Looks like they work. <laughs> going in for guns. Dark Star Judy Judy. I'm going in for guns. Oop, oh, that town's gonna get riddled with bullets in a second. Hmm? Uh, now this is the time I swing down the sight. Um, there's the latch. Power on. Oh, that's bright. There is a brightness control, I just don't know where it is. Yeah, that would be useful. Um, I'm just turn the gain all the way down, and that kind of fixes I, it. I, 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 <laughs> <laughs> he went for you. Oh, I see him. I can actually go for guns here. I'm in a dogfight with a hornet. Avenge me! Ah, he's gone. This thing is might get him. Yeah, he's like three miles away. There's no way in hell you're getting him. Extermination. Hey buddy, over here, you see these flares? Get like a radar speed thing and just lock them with that. <laughs> Come on, buddy, you gotta see that. Coward. Now that MiG 21, on the other hand, might be able to fight that. Just so happens to be one flying in my general direction, which is perfect. Request refueling. Request Copy. rearming. Copy. Alright, then F-18's coming back. Come on, you coward. Fight me! Missile, missile, missile! Ah! I saw that from way back fuck here. Okay, um, auto rotation. Um, wait, no, I need a tail rotor for that. Oh, oh, no, you don't. I, no. I don't have any road. Uh. Refueling complete. Well, this is going well. I got my crate over there. <laughs> Just Go on. One more some, crate, some, and then we can some build. Some crazy marine probably strapped a name nine to one of these things at some point. <laughs> or a stinger, at least. Or a stinger. Or maybe some guy in the back was just holding a stinger and fired it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Give me something. Well, that hornet shot me with a sparrow as well. Oh, good.
Oh, missile fired at something. Wow. I think he was coming back for seconds. <laughs> well, he's dead. Yeah. Uh, could you bring an ammo truck this time? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> bring you more stingers? Mm-hmm. Yeah, when you drop some in the field a bit farther away as well, I think. Yeah, because where they are in those trees is absolutely shit. Mm, yeah. Now, I'm not going to sit down on top of the crate this time. There we go. I would say I can go sling load that, but that thing is right next to a tree. I don't know how close that ammo truck was to meter and its maker there with all the bullet holes that hit right next to it when I dropped them off. <laughs> Rearming complete. Alright. Come on, heavy bitch. Come on! Okay, there we go, she's flying. <laughs> I need someone to listen to when I'm getting blown up. That's a good one. <laughs> Come on, man. 
of 60 should be cool enough by now. Petrovich drink all the vodka to cool. <laughs> well, that's just it. They don't use a fluid coolant. Hmm. They use an electronic coolant. Sounds like nothing could go wrong. <laughs> One thing I know, electricity and the military never really liked each other. <laughs> Something I do to prevent having to look down to sit my uh, master arm is just tell my co-pilot, hey, uh, go free fire and then hold fire. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I love the nighttime effect on those uh, tracers. <laughs> There's my corpse. Which one? Yeah. The one in the river, the one on the ground. Oh, Harrier inbound. Beware. Yep. From my carrier. Uh, where is he coming from? Uh, the north. Copy. Like 15 mile. Yeah. Sound. Seems like he's turning for our SAM site. SAMs are gonna hit him before he gets to me, hopefully. Okay. I'm gonna drop my stingers out in the middle of this field, like way out in the middle. Yeah, give us some good standoff with them. That's when I should have should brought another stinger team. Yeah, he's flying right into that rolling. Nice. Right next to his buddy's corpse as well. <laughs> you hear the story in uh, Vietnam where it was a uh, Sky Raider pilot, one of their buddies got downed or something, and he landed under gunfire and put the guy in his plane with him and then took off again. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Heavy bitch, like heavy bitch, Sam heavy bitch! I don't like how the Sam site hasn't killed him and he's turning around for me. You're having a hard time. Uh, hold thing. on, hold on, hold on! Just... <laughs> Fucking oh, oh. sit down! I hope, you, I hope you don't expect those missiles to work after that. <sighs> Alright, you lot, fuck off. Yeah, why is the the Sam site's not firing? Sam site's not firing. Sam site's not firing. All right. They're leaving me to die. Can you check out ten and let me know when he fires on me? Yeah, he's coming right for your ass. Oh yeah. He's in stinger range in three, two, one. In range. Die for those trees. Get in those trees. Fox. 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 Ooh, nice dodge. Now, where is he? I'm getting my revenge. He's your direct He's six o'clock, four o'clock, three o'clock. Guns work. He's at 6,000 feet and climbing, no, descending. There he is. Saw him in the clouds. Get back here, buddy. You don't shoot at me and get away with it. <clears throat> he's at 460 knots. You're not catching him. Okay, but you can shoot at me and get away with it. <laughs> he's just hanging around in Stinger's range, though. 
Yeah, this guy's been hanging out inside Sam range and not getting shot by the Sams, which is very concerning for me. Like, the he flew into rolling range for a good, like, two minutes there and didn't get shot. Hmm. Well, you're clear. He's bugging off. Yeah, I scared him with those miniguns. <laughs> <laughs> nah. I tried landing on a building with this thing earlier, like the other day. Landing went fine. It's just the building caught fire and scared the heck out of me because I landed. <laughs> everything was fine, and all of a sudden I'm engulfed in flames. I just take off. I'm like, nothing's wrong with me. It was the building. Rollins out on him. Finally. Those guys finally did their job. And... Skidoof. Boom. Oh. You going down? Nope. He is also charging into the stinger range on the sand. Mm -hmm. There we go. Triple A's opening oh, up. And missing by a country and mile. Oh, there he goes. He's in. Punched out. Alright, where do you want the ammo truck? Where do you want the ammo truck at? Uh, these guys are moving. My lights on. I'll go hover over to where these guys are. And I just drop it next to them. Yeah. invention mankind ever came up with tracer rounds <laughs> think about how boring gunfights would look <laughs> or at least gun runs from aircraft yeah I think I see you over there. Yeah, I see the troops as well. Yeah. Alright, prepare for the landing. Whoa. Hilo decided I wanted to try to pull a cobra there, and I fixed it. Nice. Okay. Looks like we don't have any more customers. Good. Don't want any more. There we go. Airspeed. Visual on you. Power. Just remember to slow down before you touch the ground. Yeah. A bit low, pull up. There you go. Fifteen minutes. Whoa, mm -hmm. missile, missile, gun, gun, gun! I can get him! Oh! I almost got him! You got strafed by something and he got splashed. You good? I don't have a left wing anymore. 
Ah, you're fine. Who needs wings anyways? You're a helicopter. Other than that, I think I'm fine. Now that is what I call a land. Oh, oh, besides that little spin at the end there, but we don't talk about that. <laughs> All right, get your ammo crate down. I'll go. Yeah, what the heck just tried shooting us even? I have no idea. All I know is I see you, and then all of a sudden a blob of green just took over. <laughs> Killed two of the infantry, I think. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, that's just your wingtip. <laughs> Never mind. I almost got a gunshot on him there. <laughs> My R60s still aren't warmed up. Um, maybe it's because, like, two of them are missing. <laughs> I don't know, man. By the way, you got a fuel leak from the looks of it. Yeah, I'm sure I do. Was the fob set up? Not yet. I've got the last crate on board. <laughs> we gotta race on over there. If you think you're not gonna be able to make it, drop it and I'll try and get the crate over there. I'm fine. Yeah. It's because I was sitting on the ground with my lights on that he saw me. repair it the fob if we build one? No. Dang. But we only have I find like it funny how yeah, I find it funny how we do all this and there's like five minutes left. Yeah. But I'm getting this fob built, god damn it. See I'm using the A ten cell um break here. Ah uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, why'd my game freeze? We good. We good. Fop is building. I landed a tad close to you. <laughs> I have no idea where you are. I'm coming back. I'm at your uh, 5 o'clock, really close, like 20 feet. Yep currently below you now so the pop's gonna spawn somewhere and I'm not entirely sure where so you might so I should take off <laughs> I'm directly above your tail watch out um move please yeah actually you know what I'll just swing the tail this way okay you're clear yeah hey I'm actually using my mirrors huh? beep beep Beep. Watch it. Beep. There you go. Ooh, it's kind of close. Party time! Bob is built. Let's go. Now, I think it'd be cool if they added, like, four PvP slots on for ya. <laughs> Maybe. Depends how they did it, I guess. So that way, when you're attacking an airbase, you're not fighting just the AI. Oh, someone's shooting at something over there, I think. That's me. Are you shooting the infantry? More or less. Yeah. <sighs> what infantry? 
Actually, where's that down pilot at? Yeah, he's over here. All right, searchlight on. I'm looking for the guy. <laughs> <laughs> Come out with your hands in the air. I think he's to the north a bit. Those are our guys. Oh. Yeah, he's near him. Oh, I see him. Oh, right, from that other thing that died. Oh. Those are our guys. Yeah, I know. Pull over. Did you hit me? I might have, sorry. <laughs> I heard a clunk. shoot this guy. Okay, come on, buddy. Oh, you're the luckiest man alive right now. It's like my co-pilot's inputting some controls at the last second to keep me from committing a war crime here or something. <laughs> oh, that's just you smoking right there. Some of that had to have hit him. Nope, he's fine. This is about to, though. There we go, that just raked across his legs. He shouldn't have any legs left. If I swing around and he's still stand. I'm starting to think they don't put a health bar on these guys. <laughs> Watch it! I'm downrange. Okay. <laughs> now he's ought to be dead. Watch it, I'm on me. <laughs> Here we go, this is gonna Alright, he's just invincible. I just lit him up right there. Oh wait, no, just no, that's hitting him. It's just not doing nothing. Well, that's lame. Can I pick him up? Can I extract him for intel or something here? No one to unload. Okay. Oi, watch your fire. I'm at ammo. Those are very large rounds. You think I could shoot you down? I mean, Maybe. probably. If you can hit me. That was a hit. <laughs> I heard that. I, I hit the the where the all the rotor blades connect. The, oh, the main mast. Yeah, the main mast. I should probably stop firing. Don't feel like getting banned. Yeah, probably. But the sky's not my friend. Whoa, something's here. Yeah? Some guy in a plane is here. Player? Player. Huh. Wait, no, enemy. MiG-19. <laughs> that guy just tried to kill you. I'm in a dogfight with him now. I'm getting my air-to-air -air kill with this guy. Oh, I see him. Yeah, he's a bright boy. Come on, Stingers. Light him up. Oh, no, I pulled back. Oh, 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 I did something. I popped the rotor blade off. Oh, crap. Boom. I popped it off. <laughs> Come on, Stingers. Got Take him. Here. There's no. an F-15. Wonderful. Where's our bloody a, stinger cover, huh? Oh, he's he's at thirty thousand feet. Don't worry. Mm 
That 19 is full burner right now. Mm hmm. I see him. What I don't see is a stinger ramming up his ass. Hmm. Maybe our guys don't like us anymore after we shot at him a couple times. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what it is, but Sam's don't like the fire right before the mission restart or something. Hmm. Maybe the server starts slowly deactivating the AI or something. Yeah, I pulled back too much. I started to recover, but I put nose forward too fast. I hear a pop, and then the master caution pops on. <laughs> that is called a mast bump. Mm-hmm. It's called someone's gonna get a very deadly frisbee surprise. Speaking of, I found the frisbee. Oh, where? <laughs> it's like in oh, the I little see it. field. <laughs> yeah. um, oh! I saw those come in. You're 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 gone. You gotta bail out when you hit the ground. Now this thing is bloody fire. Whoa! Why did you just ascend into the sky and blow up? What? I don't know. I did. You were at the ground all of a sudden. You just ascended up. Everything just popped off your helicopter. Now you're just kind of hovering there with no rotors, no tail, no wings. Um, well,